deep into the Nigerian rainforests, a group of cacao farmers are clearing out a patch of land in order to grow their next harvest. But the Omo Reserve is a protected area where deforestation and agriculture are banned. We know that this is a protected area, but when we are done, we will all go back to our village to start our own business. The government says it evicted all illegal farmers from the area in 2007, but they've gradually been returning as global demand for chocolate has continued to rise. In order to combat these illegal practices, groups of rangers patrol the area on a daily basis. Their mission, tracking and arresting poachers and illegal farmers, but also replanting trees in deforested areas. An uphill battle, but a crucial one to protect the only remaining vital rainforest in the country's southwest. This is one of the, um, the remaining uh, viable habitats that we can, uh, that we can have, uh, that we have forest elephants. We are faced with threat from uh, logging activities, threat from poaching and expansion of uh, farming and uh, community settlements. Nigerian cacao is purchased by some of the world's largest traders, which supply major chocolate manufacturers like Mars and Ferrero, a supply chain that could soon be affected by a new EU regulation requiring companies to prove their products haven't caused deforestation.